lovely TTs, welcome back to the channel. It looks like the best friend duo Tucson and Ari might be over after Tucson decided to come to social media today to expose Ari Fletcher for not giving him that $20,000 that she made like she gave him for his birthday. Now, Tucson's birthday was July 7th. He posted this early birthday post and it was on July the 2nd and it was of Ari giving him this huge $20,000 check. Now, we thought because these two are best friends that she was being nice and she was being generous towards her friend Tucson. These two do everything together. They're always joking around and we're thinking, oh, how cute, how nice. Okay, what a good friend. How helpful is Ari, right? Now, Tucson is deciding to make a GoFundMe today, okay? And he's letting it be known actually i didn't even get a cent of that twenty thousand dollars actually ari just did this for a show she just did this for publicity she wasn't actually giving me that twenty thousand dollars okay let's go ahead and get into what he wrote um i think this is the description of his gofundme he said i never thought that i'd be in this position but i'm reaching out for help after a heartbreaking betrayal okay my best friend promised me twenty thousand dollars for a down payment on a car as a birthday gift trusting her completely i went ahead with the start of the car purchase only to have her not give me anything despite my best efforts and hopes I did not receive any payment which actually after the camera stopped rolling and I did my heartfelt speech followed by a heartfelt text and her response was I love you too but I have a disclaimer then went silent after I received a call and I was told it was actually $10,000. She wanted to tell me, but they said that she couldn't risk not getting a good reaction out of me for the show and the internet. Now, I honestly didn't even know that this was for a show. I thought genuinely like she was just giving him $20,000 for his birthday but now it makes sense because it was a big check they both were wearing blue it did seem like maybe they were at a party but then again like I said maybe this was for the show okay and then he also said in the end I receive zero dollars from my quote-unquote my rock and we definitely know that Tucson is always calling Ari his rock if you guys watch their cooking show you know okay he also said it was all for clout in the media to benefit her financial gain and her reputation and we're gonna get into how I told you guys, okay? And I have to, I have to 100% have these videos where I was telling you guys these things. And a lot of you guys were like, where's your receipts? Where's your proof? But I just felt like it was super obvious, okay? I just had that feeling that a lot of these things that Ari is saying that Moneybag Yo and everybody else is doing for her, they're not doing for her she's doing for herself but she's acting like other people are doing it and basically a lot of these things that these celebrities do is mostly for publicity and it's not true a lot of people have to stop falling for the okie doke now he also said now your generosity can make a world of difference any contributions no matter how small is deeply appreciated i am so very grateful for your support and kindness during this challenging time okay and then he has the don who question mark so like i said a lot of shade in there it seems like these two may not be friends anymore so far Ari has not responded to this and she has not said anything so it does seem like Tucson is telling the truth maybe they're into something behind the scenes I'm pretty sure they probably got into an argument about this situation I can believe in from what I'm reading Tucson probably was continuously and consistently coming at Ari for this $20,000 and he felt like at this point I have to do what I have to do because it has been what a whole month okay probably going on two months at this this point and she has not sent him that money okay so he feels some type of way and i can understand where tucson is coming from some people may say and i've seen some people in the comments saying that tucson shouldn't be so uptight about the situation it's not ari's responsibility to be paying him if they are just best friends but at the end of the day you cannot play with someone and tell them that you're giving them this money for a down payment on a car or giving them this money to pay off their car and they're going through with the process and you're actually playing around with them like that's that's a lot of playing to do that's that's nothing cool especially when it comes to a down payment on a car or paying for a car okay that's that's crazy that's a little wild to tell someone yeah i'm giving you this money and then end up giving them nothing then lowering it to half of it ten thousand dollars and then this person not receiving anything he's already went through with the process just don't say anything at all if you feel like you're not obligated as a friend to give your friend any money that's cool you can feel 
feel that way, okay? Some friendships do work out that way, but don't say you're gonna do it and play this person and never give it to them and expect them to feel no type of way because at some point, you have to understand you are playing with their life. Now, I do wanna go ahead and get into some other tweets that I've seen. One person said, so Ari didn't give Tucson $20,000. She gave him $10,000. Then somehow it turned out to be $0. She did all of that for the show. So he purchased the car and now he's stuck with the expensive car and Ari didn't give him anything that's so effed up. Another person said, Tucson think that we give a F, Ari ain't give him 20K, she gave him 10K, go get a job like the rest of us. The F, another person said, so is Tucson lying about Ari not giving him 20K or is he for real? Another person said, wait, so Ari ain't give Tucson 20K for real and they done fell out? Another person said, girl, Ari gave Tucson a bad check for his B-Day. He said it was only 10K and he still can't cash. So he created a GoFundMe for the cash. And then this person ended up putting a whole bunch of red flags. And like I said, this is definitely an I told you moment. And I'm going to make sure I either make a separate video so I could show you guys. Like even down to the fact where just a few years ago, Ari was acting like Moneybag Yo had got her this jet or whatever. And I was like... Ari definitely did that for herself but for promotional reasons she wants to be that it girl like her main title and what she wants to be known as in this whole influencer industry is being that it girl that girl who's rich that girl who has that money and that girl who has it like that so she's going to do anything necessary to make it seem like that even if it's these publicity stunts which is not cool because now you got your friend and something messed up all because you wanted to play games with money and act like you have it all when there's really no need to flex so I hope this teaches people a lesson now like I said Ari has not responded to anything that Tucson said I'm pretty sure there's going to be more to this situation i cannot imagine ari not saying anything about this because we know that she's always coming out to the media and saying something and we know that her and tucson are very close so for these two to have fallen out this is shocking this might mean there's no more cooking with the dawn they might not be on the show together anymore and we know that these two actually make the show unfortunately i want to know what you guys think about this in the comment section like i said don't be given into what these celebrities and influencers be doing because obviously most likely they don't even have it like that they really want to convince a lot of people that they do so they can make you feel down about your life or like you don't have a lot of money or make you feel like if you're not doing what they are doing that you're not cool or that you're not doing good in life and that's not what that means there's a lot of people out here working regular nine to five jobs being a doctor being a nurse or whatever who's doing way better than a lot of these influencers who are making like they have it and they really don't have it like that now by no means necessary i'm not saying that ari probably doesn't have a big bag but there's definitely a reason why you didn't decide to give your friend that twenty thousand dollars something is not adding up if that's really your friend and y'all been around each other and i'm pretty sure he's been asking you so why haven't you given it to him okay like i said y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section um so far tucson has only raised a hundred and seven dollars okay so he might need a little bit more money it might have raised from then it might have raised higher than that since i've last checked on it i'm gonna take a screenshot of it and just post it here whatever it raised to but you know what i'm saying he's asking for the full twenty thousand dollars and i can understand where people are coming from when they're like hold up just get a job honey okay i understand a lot of people want to be rappers they want to be singers they want to be influencers but sometimes you got to get that regular job to support your dreams and i feel like at this point maybe tucson needs to do this because him being connected to Ari obviously unfortunately it's just not making him enough money you guys let me know what you think in the comment section once again thank you for watching room for tea I'll see you guys in my next video have a blessed rest of your night the dawn is coming we're gonna be at camp August 29th do not miss it I'm turning up per usual we've been at the ball okay I cannot wait y'all know I love to come to Houston that's my favorite place ever in the world so August 29th we at camp it's the up. Uh.